She was carrying an enhanced shield module. Let's see what I can find out about her. Accessing. This is Spartan Bonita Stone, recon specialist. Her vitals have been offline for nearly a month. Cause of death was an energy blade, but different, stronger. A single strike. She never saw it coming. Halo Infinite is a very personal, emotional story, and Halo in general, the franchise, is a very emotional one, but I've never felt empathy quite like I do for this Spartan Stone. We encountered her first in Shadows of Reach, and that is a fantastic book. She was one of the Infinity's main Spartans, and she just met a sad end in Halo Infinite. Hello once again, YouTube, and welcome back to The Domain. I wanted to make this video because this Spartan, alongside Spartan Griffin, has a very interesting tie to the toys that I just wanted to talk about. Fans of Halo Mega Constructs met Spartan Stone almost a year ago in original product images, and it's just so interesting to finally see her in the campaign, and such a shame she had a quick demise. This is Halo Heroes Series 14, and these images have been out for a long time. I finally got to review the product recently, but people have had these in their hands for months and months, and they came with two Spartans on the left, Spartan Stone and Spartan Griffin. You can see on their base plate they're only labeled as Spartan Trailblazer and Spartan Mark 7. I believe we're seeing long-standing ramifications in these toys, right? Because Halo Infinite was delayed by a year, the toy and merchandise companies had to scramble once that happened, because they had no merch. Every toy that was set for a 2020 or Spring 2021 release probably had to be changed considerably, considering all the information in Halo Infinite had to be kept a secret for another full year. So this Spartan, in some list listings on websites was listed as Spartan Stone, the same way the purple Spartan was listed as Spartan Griffin. There was a great debate in the last year in the community as to whether it was actually a named Spartan or just a typo on a website, but no, we now finally have proof that unfortunately Spartan Stone is dead, and that is a real shame. I don't know, man, it's like I can speak on behalf of the collectible community where we've known about this character for like a year, so it's just really gut-wrenching to see what happened to her. I absolutely love love this figure in Halo Heroes in Mega Constructs form, so I really wish I'd got some more time to sort of get to know her in the campaign. I'm still hopeful that we will see the last minutes of the Infinity in some kind of cutscene, but this is all we've got right now, Spartan Stone. And I was wondering recently whether the camo pattern on this figure was accurate to the game. It looks like Mega could have definitely made some more camo patterns on the shoulders and arms, maybe even the tops of the legs, but still, all in all, a great figure, and they did change the visor from the in-game gold to this light blue. Probably just a fun nod to the camo pattern on her armor, basically. So that's all we've got for today, folks. Spartan Stone, rest in peace. And I just wanted to make this quick bit of lore tie in from the toys to the game. I thought you might find it pretty interesting. So thanks so much for the support, everyone. You stay awesome, you stay safe, and stick it with the domain for all your Halo collecting news. Let us never forget those who journeyed into the howling dark and did not return. They ennobled all of us, and they shall not be forgotten.